if you've seen any of the ads for rise of kingdoms then you know that one of the things players care about the most is power i mean it's going to get your first class on flights it's going to get you to fix your relationship with your wife you will be the hero of your own story if you just have enough power in rise of kingdoms but who has the most power in rise of kingdoms well that's the question we're going to answer today because today we're going to go over the top 10 most powerful players in the entire game because it has been six months since we've discussed the top 10 most powerful players here in rise of kingdom so without further ado what's going on guys cheers now one of the things people always ask me when i talk about the highest power is okay but who has the highest kill points in rise of kingdoms and to that i say i literally already made a video about that one month ago and i'm sure the list hasn't changed very much so if you're interested in the highest kill point players check out that video and if you missed that video that means you're probably not subscribed pretty embarrassing i know but i forgive you don't worry about 65 percent you guys are not subscribed and you might think that you are so go down there and double check and if you want to not miss a video click the bell and drop a thumbs up while you're down there okay let's jump into the top 10 highest power players in rise of kingdoms coming in at number 10 we have boom 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 three in kingdom 1960 this player is sitting at 712 million power with 21.3 billion kill points taking a look at that breakdown we have 15.1 billion tier 5 kill points 6 billion tier 4 kill points if we jump into the more information section we can see that the highest power ever was actually 764 million so they lost about 50 million power which is crazy because that's like some people's entire account and they have 143 million dead troops taking a look at champions of olympia currently in copper with highest league ever being glorious gold two eight out of 17 arc of osiris wins and one championship title very cool stuff there taking a look at the lost kingdom performance we have two autarchs and four participations under their belt with 211 million units killed 37.5 million units lost and 233 million units healed jumping into the commander view we don't get any details here except for who they actually are we have Nevsky as the drill master, Julia Leung as the iron guard, Liu Che as the charge captain. Very interesting choice there. I guess they're doing some infantry rallies because obviously we have Tarek the constable here. Maybe I, I have no idea. And we have Mulan as the ranger. Very cool stuff. Taking a look at the album, we have a little puppy. Very, very cute stuff. You're going to drop a thumbs up. Oh my God. That's look at he's looking at his lips. Oh, he's such a cutie, man. That's so fluffy too. He's got a little shirt on. Where are they, by the way? Wait, is this like a private jet or is this like an rv or something like what is going on here i'm assuming this is the the private jet but hey yo boom 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 three what do you do for a living brother i mean we got a drag i think this is a drag racing car i don't know anything about cars or racing or anything like that so are you in the industry is this a hobby like what's going on here obviously balling out of absolute control but very very impressive stuff obviously incredible account to go along with it rocking the germany civilization this must mean that they're in the off season of course they're in 60 gt and it's kind of crazy that 712 million power is the start of our list today right like remember back in the day even six months ago uh number 10 on the list was in the 600 millions same thing with december of of last year and i mean man these these powers they're just creeping up anyway moving on to number nine on the list we have none other than bt cyborg in kingdom 2377 rocking the germany civilization as well and he's sitting at 772 million power with 43 3.6 billion kill points 38 billion at tier 5 5.4 billion at tier 4. this player has been on the top 10 list i think forever as far back like even if we go all the way back to i think early 2021 if not 2020 and beyond like this play this player is always on the top 10 okay they're always top 10 highest power in the game of course kill points also insane on this player's account taking a look at the more information we see that their highest power ever was 836 million with 236 million dead troops truly an incredible account here taking a look we have 47 out of 62 arc of osiris wins under their belt zero championship titles taking a look at the lost kingdom stats we have two autarchs and five participations 495 oh my god i bet you they're so upset it wasn't 500 right 500 so close to 500 million units killed in a single kvk 
with 50 million units lost and 449 million units healed actually insane actually an insane player jumping into the commander view we have the Zhuge Liang as the drill master we have Guan Yu as the iron guard we have Nevsky as the charge captain and Liu Che as the constable so this is all open field commanders here it looks like this player perhaps doesn't do any rally or garrison which is kind of shocking considering how powerful they are they probably have everything in the game maybe they just move these things around a lot or maybe they open field more than they rally in garrison so they just optimize for that I have no idea we have Cao Cao as the Ranger it's always interesting to see players like this using Cao Cao I assume that this is for doing forts like barbarian forts if you've spent any amount of money in the game you should be using Minamoto to rally forts it is just always going to be better from a hospital perspective you're going to deal more damage and you're going to kill the fort faster a lot of people think like oh well I want to march to the fort faster it's like yeah that, that's fair but it with Cao Cao you're going to kill it slower so you're still losing time either way might as well get a better trade on the hospital especially if you're using tier five which you should never be doing unless like I don't know you're struggling with lost kingdom forts or something I don't know anyway that's a totally different rant obviously BT cyborg has never struggled with a barb fort in his life taking a look at the album this is an album we have seen before this is everything related to Captain America it looks like we have some we got some Star Trek over here I'm gonna get some hate comments for that which is cool I'm just farming guys I know what it's from it's from Star Wars okay we've got Superman over here big fan of the superhero movies here very cool stuff anyway moving on to number eight on the list we have none other than Yoda 808 in Kingdom 2605 also rocking the Germany civilization and is sitting at 865 million power with 24.2 billion kill points looking at the breakdown we have 17.5 billion tier 5 kill points and 6.6 .6 billion tier 4 kill points and I gotta say Yoda used to be the number one highest power player in all of Rise of Kingdoms now I have actually heard that Yoda has been having some health issues and that is what's causing this account to be a little bit dormant these days so I have no further details about that um Yoda if you're watching this I hope you're doing well first of all and if you are and you're up for it shoot me a message in game let me know how you're doing maybe I can update some people who are wondering where is Yoda anyway jumping into the more information section you could see exactly what I was just talking about highest power ever 1.8 billion power so literally lost a billion power on this account truly insane we have 362 million dead troops an absolute gargantuan power drop which is I mean that's what giga chads do you know what I mean like if you're willing to kill that many uh, it's crazy it's basically crazy anyway moving over to the commander view we have the feature disable so very interesting stuff here I didn't I actually didn't even know you could disable that I guess you can well you can hide commander details and you can and hide talent info is it is hide commander details make it so that nobody can see anything oh it says hide commander details if this option is selected visitors will only be able to view the names of your commanders okay so I have no idea what's going on here this might be bugged or something but yeah taking off the album nothing in the album here if we look at the Ark of Osiris performance we have 23 out of 43 Ark of Osiris wins and looking at the Lost Kingdom we have one autark out of three participations we have 240 million units killed at 70 7.7 million units lost so that's a 777 right there lucky number and we have 182.8 million units healed it's kind of insane that you can lose a billion power and still be on the top 10 highest power list in rise of kingdoms speaking of a billion power moving on to number seven we have none other than perfume of Mimi also rocking the Germany civilization sitting at a clean 1 billion 600 million power and 33.1 1 billion kill points with 23.7 billion tier 5 kill points 9.2 billion tier 4 kill points and is currently in kingdom 1175 of course people who have watched these videos before know that Mimi is no stranger to these lists of course neither are the rest of the people on this list but Mimi is always in the top 10 list and it seems like they they just never fall below a billion power they just don't do it it's just they like to be a billion power and I mean if you could pull that off I'd be like that's awesome I wish I could do that they have 69 Ark of Osiris wins nice out of 87 fought we have three out of four autarks in Lost Kingdom performance 221 million units killed 22.9 million units lost and 140 million units healed taking a look at the more information we have highest power ever of 1 billion 40 million 
so again I it, they just like to stay right there they just hover in that area and they're big chilling we have 190.5 million dead troops as well jumping into the commander view we see lots of garrison commanders very interesting stuff here we have Yanzisko, we have Hera we have Dito and we have Eleanor so expertise to everything here we of course have Gorgo and Flavius as well uh basically just flexing literally everything here and the Moctezuma for the uh PVE content which of course if they are doing PVE content you you probably I don't, like what you're missing out on like some really important stuff over here like well anyway it's Mimi it, who cares they don't need this at all if you want some garrison builds of course you can go ahead and take a look at Mimi's account here uh they'll have all the garrison builds that they're currently using and it's always cool to see what the top tier players are doing with Dito here you do not need that third point in rejuvenate by the way just two out of three is perfectly fine everything after that is pretty much over raging especially if you're getting swarmed taking a look at the album we have this album is pretty much the same as it's always been I'm pretty sure I've seen every single picture here a million times because we've made this video often and nothing here really seems to have changed but of course that is not where the fun ends with Mimi because Mimi also takes number six on the list here with their flower of Mimi account so again two accounts with a billion power actually insane here also again rocking Germany in 1175 same alliance we have 1 billion 14 million power so technically higher we have 30.9 billion kill points with 23.2 billion tier 5 and 7.5 billion tier 4 kill points the flower of Mimi account actually pulling out one more arc of Osiris win than the previous account perfume of Mimi we have 70 out of 88 battles fought where wins for arc of Osiris which is nice we have three out of four autarks which is crazy 215.6 million units killed 20.9 million units lost and 137 million units healed taking a look at the more information we have again 1 billion 43 million highest power 150 million dead troops and the commander view shows off once again a bunch of garrisons so Mimi is garrison queen in in their kingdom it looks like we have even Theodora here Dito Gorgo Eleanor I guess Mimi's just maxing out all the women and they just happen to be all garrison commanders maybe I don't know taking a look at the album once again we see everything here is pretty much the same there's no change here on the album we've seen this album many times before I hope the horse is doing well definitely one of the more unique animals we see in any of the albums here on uh Rise of Kingdoms <laughs> moving on to number five we have none other than Baba TC Ataturk of course always on the top 10 list and and is I think always in the top five as well and of course back in the day Baba used to be the number one most powerful player in Rise of Kingdoms like of all time occasionally bumping over other players that we'll talk about in this uh in this video but Baba comfortably sits around the 1 billion to 1.2 billion point area pretty much no matter what they don't seem to really care to be the most powerful player in the game because their kill points speak for themselves we have 1.2 billion power here also rocking the Germany civilization in kingdom 2429 70 billion kill points of course the highest we've seen in the video so far and might be the highest we see throughout the rest of the video I don't remember but we'll find out taking a look we have 57.5 billion tier 5 kill points and 12.4 billion tier 4 kill points we have 65 out of 86 arc of Osiris wins and we have zero out of four lost kingdom autarchs with 612 million units killed 43 million units lost and 414 million units healed actually insane the kill to heal ratio here is wild taking a look at the more information section we see highest power ever 1.3 billion like I said Baba seems to always stick around this range here no point in really going any higher it's not like he can do more with that I mean Baba can accomplish as many kills as he wants just fine with his current power level 328 million dead troops as well truly insane stuff here taking a look at the commander view we have Yui Liang as the drill master Guan Yu as the iron guard we have Justinian as the charge captain and Trajan the constable it's good to see people still rocking Trajan in the field I assume there's no I mean what else would you use Trajan for but anyway taking a look at the album here this is once again all pictures we have seen already here on the channel I feel like I've done these episodes so often that I'm like I can't I want like an update on these players like I want to see I want to see them update the album like what do, what have you been up to lately you know what I mean like what's life been like lately you know I don't know that's probably just parasocial anyway moving on to number four on the list we have of course Maverick L now this player used to be once again the highest power player in the entire game 
time not much is known about Maverick L but what is certain is that the power change from this episode and six months ago uh we see about 200,000 power change increase so not sure what's going on with Maverick don't know if they quit the game I mean gaining 200,000 power in six months I mean I I've gained more than like what do you are you training tier one like what's what's going on here I have no idea uh currently in kingdom 1322 also rocking the Germany civilization we so far have seen every player on the list here rocking Germany with 10.3 billion kill points we have 7.5 billion tier 5 kill points and 2.8 billion tier 4 kill points looking at the more information section highest power ever 1.5 billion power 196.5 million dead troops taking a look at the Ark of Osiris we have 26 out of 35 wins and we have one autark out of two lost kingdom participations 47.3 million units killed 21.9 million units lost and 40 million units healed looking at the commander view we see that this feature is once again not enabled so what is going on with these accounts where you can't see their commander view does that imply that these accounts are off the home kingdom map still or are they like you know did they go offline during kvk and now kvk is over and then they never came back online to spawn in on the home kingdom map like what's going on here not sure again no album nothing like that so yeah wonder what happened here to maverick l's account moving on to number three on the list we have mr hope which is so far uh the youngest account that we've seen on this entire list Mr. Hope currently sitting at 1.8 billion power in Kingdom 2377, rocking the Germany civilization and 35 billion kill points. We have 29.3 billion tier five kill points and 5.5 billion tier four kill points. Taking a look at the more information section, we see highest power ever was 2 billion, truly insane, 224.9 million dead troops. We see their uh, Ark of Osiris data is hidden, but they're currently in glorious gold for champions of Olympia and they are a champion or above for their highest league ever we have five out of five autarks actually insane record right there honestly actually insane 526 million units killed 55 million units lost and 753 million units healed actual giga chad account right here taking a look at the commander view we see William Wallace as the drill master we have Guan Yu as the iron guard we have Zhu Liang as the constable and Osher Bonapal as the charge captain so it's kind of crazy how we've gone all video just now seeing William Wallace as the drill master this is the first ninth generation commander we've seen in the entire video I think oh no we saw Eleanor who was a uh, garrison but I mean you would think that we would see more like Belisarius Prime right because these players are the ones that should be swarming things down you would think that you would want the Belisarius Prime to be like the constable or something like that or I guess maybe it doesn't really matter for these guys that these are like these points are like so negligible to them that it's whatever but still it's interesting that this is the first time we've seen a ninth generation open field commander in the entire video and if you want to know why watch my most recent video where I talk about about the real truth about the ninth generation of open field commanders that will explain pretty much everything but either way William Wallace definitely the strongest in my opinion of the ninth generation open field commander so it makes sense that they would be here taking a look at the album I'm pretty sure we've seen this album before we have 51.8 million dead troops for this Hall of Heroes here we have 55.1 million dead troops for the Hall of Heroes truly uh insane stuff here on the account but yeah I think we've seen that album already and of course we can't talk about Mr hope if we don't talk about wild lion this is of course a father-son duo we actually made a video going over their accounts and that was a while ago I'd really be interested to see what has changed since then but wild lion technically number two highest power in all of rise of kingdom sitting at 1 billion 815 million power just 3 million power higher than mr hope but again these two are basically a package deal also in kingdom 2377 rocking the germany civilization we have 30.29 billion kill points we have 24.5 billion tier 5 kill points and 5.7 billion tier 4 kill points also in glorious gold for champions of olympia with the champion above league being their highest and again five out of five autarks 
for the lost kingdom truly insane 354 million units killed 54 million units lost and 357 million units healed highest power ever was also 2 billion truly insane here 229 million dead troops and the commander view is going to look identical as far as I can tell I think this is identical except the ranger was different I think they had Richard as the ranger over there on Mr Hope but even still very good stuff here and of course a very similar album here for Wildline as well 51 million units lost 25 million coming back here we got 54 million units lost for this one yeah truly insane stuff I wonder what would happen if you took a shot every time I said insane in a rise of kingdoms video you probably would not make it but anyway moving on to number one on the list of course we have Ekrem Abi sitting at 1 billion 862 million power in kingdom 3281 rocking the Germany civilization we have 7.3 billion kill points 3.2 billion tier 5 kill points 4 billion tier 4 kill points and this is without a doubt the youngest account on this entire list you can tell by the kill points you can tell by the player ID Ekrem Abi came out of nowhere very recently recently a couple months ago just popped off actual giga chad status 19 out of 24 arc of osiris wins and we have zero out of four lost kingdom autarchs 256 million units killed 31.9 million units lost and 120 million units healed take a look at the more information we see highest power ever also 2 billion but still a bit higher than the others here just to prove a point this is the highest power player ever in rise of kingdoms 71.4 million dead troops has anyone gone higher than this from like a highest power perspective I don't think so I don't think so I think this is like truly the highest ever which is insane taking a look at the commander view we are unable to look at the commander view once again what is the deal here I'm very confused jumping over to the album no album here as well so yeah uh, it's also worth noting that I'm pretty sure Ekram's farm is like 300 million power as well in case you guys were wondering so yeah or maybe that's just a player that's a fan and they named themselves after him but I'm pretty sure it's them it's the same kingdom same alliance all the same stuff here so yeah even the farm is like actually insane but I can't see I can't see the commander view what's going on here anyway guys that's gonna do it for the video those were the top 10 highest power players in all of rise of kingdoms and if you made it to the end of the video consider dropping a thumbs up it really helps out the channel a ton it'll help push this video out into the YouTube algorithm so other rise of kingdoms players might see it while you're down there consider subscribing to the channel and clicking the bell to be notified the next time I upload a rise of kingdoms video and comment down below your favorite player on this list who do you think is the most impressive out of the top 10 highest power players is it Ekrem for being the highest ever and getting to that point so quickly is it Mr Hope and Wild Lion for being I mean combined it's like 3.6 billion power is it Mimi because it's one person with two billion power or is it Baba because he has the highest kill points like I I'm curious to know who you think is the most impressive player here on this list let me know in the comment section below and with that being said guys thank you so much for watching this has been Omniarch I will talk to you guys again soon peace